Hey, what's up everybody? My name's Star Lord. I hope that you're all having a fantastic day. It's a beautiful weekend here in the UK and uh, yeah, I think I've got toothpaste over my mouth. I'm not too sure. But anyway, today's video, we have another week, another leak. Yes, that's right. The week four challenges for season four have actually been leaked early once again as every other week, you know. This will probably be a video that I do every single week. So uh, yeah, today we're going to be looking at those and giving you a kind of insight on what you have to prepare for once Tuesday actually arrives. Uh, now before we do get into the video guys, please do not forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Fortnite videos just like this one right here. And uh, yeah, let's get into talking about today's video. Uh, so we're going to get straight into this, there's no hang up or anything like that. We're going to just go straight on and get through the challenges. So the first challenge that we're going to be uh, faced with on a week four is actually deal damage with assault rifles to opponents. For this we get five battle stars and we also have to deal 1000 damage to opponents. Uh, so yeah it's actually not really that hard to be honest if you're playing for the whole week you should be able to get this fairly easy. Now we're going to be moving on to the second one which I know a lot of people are really really gonna hate. Yes guys it has returned. Search chests in Wailing Woods. I know, I know, right? I know. Well, for this one, we have to search seven chests in Wailing Woods, and it will only get us five Battle Pass stars, and believably, it's not actually a hard challenge, which it is. It's a hard challenge. I remember doing this specifically, and it took me ages to do. Uh, so good luck to you all on this one, guys, because, oh my god, I racked my brain last time I had to do this. Then the next one we're going to be looking at is search seven ammo boxes in a single match. Again, this one isn't actually that hard. You can do that fairly easy throughout the match. And uh, for the seven that you actually collect, you will get five Battle Pass stars. So pretty darn easy. Uh, we're going to move on to the next one, which is a brand new one that they've never done before, but I kind of really don't see the point of it. It is visit the center of, st of different storm circles in a single match. And that has to be three. So in all of the match, so for the entirety of the match, you have to visit the storm circle in the very middle of it three times. Now that one right there is not a hard one, I don't know why, but uh, yeah, that seems like it's going to be really, really difficult, guys. Um, other than that, that will get you five Battle Pass stars, and let's move on to the next one, which is actually a new Battle Pass star kind of secret area thing. I already know where the location is of this, and I'm actually going to be recording it in a day or two, and it says here, search between a bench, ice cream truck, and a helicopter. This, of course, is a hard challenge. You only have to find one Battle Pass star spinning around, and it will get, grant you 10 Battle Pass stars. So, yeah, I know where that is already, guys, so subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for the guide on this a day early. And uh, other than that, we have Trap Eliminations, which is, an, again, going to be a hard one. And this is going to be hard because they've actually made the traps deal less damage. Like, how the heck... Are we going to be able to do that? Uh, but basically, we only have to get one trap eliminations and it will give us 10 battle pass stars. But other than that, I don't see how they've thought through these challenges. Like trap eliminations and now the traps only do 85 damage? No. No, it's not going to happen. Hardly anyone's going to get that. I swear to you. Um, and then last but not least, we do have one more challenge, which is eliminate opponents in Snobby Shores. This is again going to be a hard challenge. You only have to kill three opponents, and also you do get 10 Battle Pass Stars. Kind of putting it together for 50 Battle Pass Stars altogether if you complete the Week 4 challenges. Now that's pretty much it for today's video guys, I do hope that you enjoyed it and that you enjoyed the early leak kind of uh, view I guess. Um, I would also like to say that in the description of today's video guys, I actually have a link over to my Facebook page. I know it's very weird having a Facebook page, but I'm actually going to be doing a lot of exclusive giveaways over on that page. So if that's something that you'd be interested in, getting some free V-Bucks skins when you can actually give them to people and everything, uh, go and check that out because yeah, I will be doing them within the next month. So once uh, I believe, uh, yeah, let's see, once uh, June starts, I'll be doing exclusive giveaways pretty much every single week over on that Facebook page. Uh, so go over, follow it, and uh, make sure to like the page itself. Uh, but anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. Have an awesome day, and until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.